lucky cat that he killed back with Night in the Woods! Where's Night? Come on. For like two seconds. There we go. Okay, let me plug it into a different outlet. Outlet? Yeah. USB port. Alright, I'm gonna run the interference. What do you do your thing? Oh. What do you mean? I'm gonna distract the clear. I can do it, yes. Okay, I will admit that drawing attention is a talent to have. I'm great at crimes! But why don't I get caught? You will, I'll just start screaming if I have to. How is that a good idea? Hey, school! Okay, but if this goes wrong, I'm blaming you. Join the club! Alright, we're helping B steal something from this store. Because we stole something and we're a bad influence. Hi! Uh huh. I got a question. T shirts are 20% off. Yeah, I saw. I was wondering about something else. Okay. The name of the store. Yeah. Ah, you probably get this question a lot. Try me. Is it like you revolution or like your revolution? So what time do you get off later? You know, no one ever asks this, but I think about it all the time. Hi, Black. God. You know what the official business name on our check is? You Revolution, Radical Youth Culture, Uprising, Inc. That's really dumb. Pretty cool place to park, huh? That's really dumb. Oh, God, I know. Like, guys, can't we just be a store that sells cool shit to teens? Yeah, teens go nuts for this shit. The employee discount is also pretty great. I had a job once. I had a hundred percent discount. Uh huh. When I stole shit. No, I got what you meant the first time. I bet you grab things all the time. Well. They're big into prosecuting the, the frivolous extent of the law here, so... Okay, I'm done looking. Let's go. Okay, it was nice talking to you. Bye now. Uh... The, uh... Excuse me. Why did I do that? You did so well, B. Oh, I call the cops on shoplifters at my own store. This. What did you get? What did you get? Some kind of necklace thing? Noise. Noise. Oh, God. Okay, we're home free. Really? Yeah, we're like out in open waters now. I feel kind of sick. Let's walk it off. Wow, I completely forgot about this Joy of Fisher. Oh my god, I loved her. Did you ever come to the Summer Days thing here? Yeah, it likes sport people. I still have no idea how they did that. I just assumed it was some guy in there with a sport gun. One time I saw it knock down a guy. I saw it was some, thought it was some guy. And no, I was totally a found they to check out sport people. That's amazing! 
<laughs> you know the walkway up there? Past the upper food court thing. Up in the atrarium. Now what? The ceiling. The glass part that points up. Yeah? When I was a kid, I thought that's where God lived. Wow. I don't know, I just, just remember staring at it when I was a kid. Like, eating a burger and trying to see if I could see God, like, peeking over or something. Looks like I got some weird art hanging up there now. Wanna go up and see? Nah, my knees are killing me from work. You up for eating? Let's check it. Let's check out the rest of the mall first. Wake up in your appetite! I was kind of hungry when we got here. Well, we'll get more hungry. Wow, this should be good. I want to know what kind of... Oh, come on! There's no one working the counter! Oh, wow. Hello? Anyone here? Please? This is a boy. Uh, hold on, let me read just myself. There we go. This is like some out of, of something out of a failed state art something. What's that? When you make a country and it doesn't work out. So, like this country? Eh. <coughs> Jeez, really? Let's see what else I got. Funky Tonk or McKinnon. Cobra Girl rolling hard on the E at this Brave remixes. Oh wow, I actually listened to that. Just to see what the hell it even means. Cobra Sky pickup trucks exactly like my uncle's. But this one is on fire and flying at a dragon spice. Upgrade. Oh hey, it's that band. What band? You know. You remember this song? How that video, like, that people posted like a zillion times? I have literally no idea what you're talking about. I have that weird horse in it. Okay, yeah, I remember I had a weird horse in it. Oh god, yeah, that horse was on. I remember. Yep, we have officially remembered that video. We did that! That's the exit. Definitely don't want to leave just yet. Yeah, let's see. Okay, I expect I expect a more excitement. Mall food court diner. Oh, what a feeling! 
see the legend board? What did you get? You inhaled it before I got a look. Pizza taco? Or... Hooray! Hero Jibberger. Pizza taco. Go for some good garbage food. Yeah, I wish we got one in town. Ooh, that would be bad for me. It'd be worth it. What? Remember when Kathy Domingo pulled out Cindy Clark's nose ring here? <coughs> you know what that was about, right? Wasn't Kathy pregnant with, what's his name, football guy? Around Bustra? I didn't know you knew about that. Well, I mean, that was the first football game I've ever seen, you and you. I'm running and ran up to the sideline and yelled at the stage. My first touchdowns for my beautiful firstborn, and his mommy, Kathy Domenico. That's... Something. Kelly was in a marching band and then she was crying, I think. And then he dumped her for Cindy a week later. Oh, yeah. See, that's the part I know about. That's what set off the whole nose ring situation. I wonder what Kathy's up to now. I wonder what Ron's doing. I wonder what happened to Cindy. I imagine she got a new nose ring. Or conversely, never wanted a nose ring ever again. You know what the worst part of this story is? The sordid high school drama, Cindy having something worked out of her face. Run. High school drama? At the time, I was like, God moves things around in the strangest ways to bring two people together. <coughs> uh, I guess. Well, it used to make things make more sense at least. Thinking about this place, I found in the god walkway and stuff. Not knowing how something used to seem, seem like magic. Now not knowing means it might be going wrong and I might not be able to fix it. Help knowing someone was at the controls, you know? Now I'm just tired from the same. From all the time, from the shop. When I was at school? Yeah. Uh, <coughs> I don't even want to talk about it. What happened, anyway? You want to run away as your motion boy? Uh, there's not really much else to run around. We could go check out the weird pipes. I don't want to touch it. Please, don't. I want to run. You run. I'm going to sit here. I'm tired and sad now. Do it yourself. Not that way. say these are amazingly well hung for some ceiling bits. You're pressing the wrong button. Oh wow! 
Can I see this? <laughs> Fantastic! Whoa, hey. Oh. Oh my god. Holy crap. How? Aw, uh, she's happy now. <coughs> uh -huh, May, I know that's you. Uh, how are you doing with that? Uh, stop, I'm gonna die. Okay, someone's gonna call the Okay, okay, someone's gonna call the cops. Ah. <coughs> Beatrice Santello! <laughs> Don't give them our names. Beatrice Jones! Oh, wow. Is that you, God? Yes, it is I! God, stupid joy! I... Didn't know you had a last name. Silence, Samora! So, feel my fish monster! I have laid waste to your kind! I'm not gonna lie, that was pretty magical. Silence! I should say it again! You and your golden noble companions shall get a scream on the way home! Uh, yeah. We should probably get out of here uh, before you're arrested. Uh. The cops shall be confused and stop and beat each other up, for I am God and I hate the cops. Okay, okay, get down here. Have a good one, mortal! Because he's. Because it's not sticking it to the man. The man isn't going to lose anything here, but he will get in a lot of trouble. He's just a clock, you know, must be a machine, you know? <coughs> sure, whatever. We're turning to shit. Okay, okay, I'm going. Hi. Hello. You're back. Yeah, we stole some shit. Here is that shit. We don't want you to get in trouble with the boss. It's not your fault the world is like this. What? You stole this? You're just a car, and a much bigger machine. To blame me away be like blaming a thing instead of a whole thing. So you're returning stolen merchandise. One day, looks like you are going to overthrow the whole thing. What whole thing? The whole thing. We are leaving. 
Be strong, you beautiful dreamer. You have nothing to lose but your chains. What? <coughs> this place used to be something. I mean, it still is something. Yeah, just a big, mostly empty thing. A big, mostly empty parking lot. Well, you work with what you have. Let's never come here again. You don't have to convince me. I only came here because you wanted to. Well, for Lucia and you, for Lucia, you should be something. Never, no, for Lucian's over. Oh, let's go. Let it die in peace. Let it die. I want to drive on the way home. Nope. Dad. Yep, Dad. Heard you had a wild time last night. I didn't drink. It works better if you let me accuse you first. Right. Here's my hangover cure. Not drinking the night before. Wow, hold on. Let me write that down. <coughs> It's complicated, I know. Anything else interesting? What did you do tonight? I know it's play. You have a good time? Yeah, she's kinda... I don't know. Like, she's older. Like, much older. And kinda... Sad. Well... She's been through a lot. Yeah. Hi, Dad. Would you mind moving the boxes in the crawl space? Well, what have you done for me lately? I've been an excellent daughter. That doesn't count. Well, would you watch some TV with me? Sure. Hold up. I'm watching Garbo and Malloy. Nice. <coughs> Welcome back, folks. Hell of a show tonight. Say, Malloy. Yes, Garbo. I have a good feeling that there's disas that disaster is right around the corner. Sure, I do. Right before we start the show every night. You're, you superstitious Scarbo! Not anymore! What happened? I've broken every mirror I've ever owned, and now I'm lucky enough to never have to look at this mug. Yeah, but what about the rest of us? What? That's a whopper. Coming up next, Garbo and I join a cult. Good night, Dad. Hope you remove those boxes. <coughs> I don't think I heard this one. No, no. No way I'm gonna play that one. Too embarrassing. Alright, I'll play this one.
shoot, I was doing so well too. <laughs> yeah, back, I hear I don't know how to play this song. Shoot. Yeah, big time. Since I got some bass practicing. Always make sure to practice. Alright, I'm gonna go over this way one more time. After I scare those birds, of course. Oh, 
this one is much nicer than the one, the last one. This dream is much nicer than the last one we had. God, that's bright. Wait, wait, I need to check my internet. Always check your internet. Does anyone want to talk to me? Yes. Hey, I got sick from the malted. It wasn't good malted. I'm working today if you want to say hello. Yep, that's my life right there. Morning! I'm working today! And guess it's out of town and I'm lonely! Okay, bye. Sincerely, Gregory. Mm. Hey, Sharky. You're my favorite. <coughs> what are you even thinking about in there? I didn't know I could go over this way. This bookshelf is like the ghost of Granddad hanging out of the corner. Maybe not his ghost, but his skeleton. Ugh. Okay, I just made myself sad. Why did I come over here? Oh, hmm. There's like something written inside this book cover. Left, right, right 100, left 22. Left right 90, right 15. Is this like what this is? From where? From here? Yes, that did. Well, yeah, let's see, where is it? Well, yeah, here it is. The floating island and other stories. Granddad didn't read out of this. He, like, recited it from memory. I made stuff up on top of that to get me to sleep when I was a kid. Miss you, dude. The floating island. She's a mold. I wish I had written those down because now I don't remember what it said. Hi, Ma. Good morning. Did you feel it last night? What? There was a big scene called Two Streets Over. Uh, are we still getting doors? I don't think those ever really go away. Swampy ground and so forth and on a floodplain. Oh, we are. I don't want you over there nosing around. I guarantee you. I won't. I've seen scene codes. No interest at all? Mom, they're just horse in the ground. Get back to me when... When it, like, spiders a house or something. We'll go see together if that happens. Deal. So what did you do last night? Went to the mod would be... Oh, Fort Lucene. Yeah. I haven't been there in years. How is it? 
kind of funny no Paul I am Billy yeah I expect everyone just goes to the outlet store is up by the interstate now for you know she's and things well stop by the church if you're in the area well do mom see ya mm-hmm bye sweetie bye mom I'm gonna go to church today I mean, I do need to see Bate and Gregory, but... Uh. <coughs> but, eh, I could wait. Church is this way, right? I don't remember where anything is. I have a map, right? I don't. So it is this way. Pardon me, everybody. Gonna go to church today. If I can ever find it. Oh, I think I know where it is. I went up this way. Yep. I want to look around first. does this go? Oops. I always wanted to climb the water tower. But then that one kid died doing that. Whatever. I'll get to it. Probably be see clear to brittle for me. Or... And that's it. Cool. I didn't think I'd be able to jump down there, but never thought I'd trip it anyway. So I can go back to the church, and then I can go see Beatrice, and then I can go see Gregory. That is my plan. Hey, Mom! Hey, sweetie! I completely forgot where the sanctuary is. Um, you passed the door on your way here. Oh, I thought those were locked. They're locked sometimes. All doors are locked sometimes. Not like saloon doors. Cowboy starts walking in and out. That's very rude. The old west was a very rude time. How do you, partner? Ah, I, I say, I say, this is powerful, right? That's like Southern Gentleman. He's classing the place up. Tar Nation. Okay, Mom, no more cowboy talk for you. Dad, come I gotta get back to work, sweetie. Love you. Love you too, Mom. <laughs> <coughs> <coughs> Hello. Hello. You're Candy's daughter, right? Yep. Who are you? 
Kate, but most call me Pastor K. You're new here, right? Sixteen months? Something like that. Ah, uh, new to me at least. Hello! Hello. Hello. Do me a favor. Take that last hello and give it to Bruce. Bruce? Bruce lives across the street. In the what? Or not, at least. You want me to go, go talk to a strange man in the woods? Bruce isn't strange. He's my friend. And he's a part of this community. Okie dokie. Thank you. It was nice to meet you. You too. Well, now I'm on a quest. Me and Gregory can wait. <coughs> Not like they're gonna go anywhere. Hello, I'm Mabel Rowski, a uh, friend of Pastor Kate. Hey, I'm Bruce. I don't say it much. That's fine. I talk a lot. But I can, like, not. I said hi. Now I can go. Say hi to Gregory or B. Not in that order, order of course. Raccoon. Wait. I did pass it. Hi, baby. Hi, my eye. How's it going? Got a load of rock salt to move. Came in early this year. And like a crap load of snow shovels. Usually the distro place doesn't go up like this. Maybe it's run by weather wizards. Yeah, that's not a bad theory. So what's up? Wanna hang out tonight? Uh, I'm working. If you wanna like... Come along. Oh, I was thinking we'd play Popeye out in Hunwick. May that. Actually, not a bad idea. But sorry, gotta work. Oh, jeez, what is even the point? Paychecks, rent, food, medicine, that kind of thing. So, do you want to come along or not? Sure. <coughs> Can you just, like, refuse to do house calls? Nope. Why? It's called a job. People pay you to do it. Ideally, at least. You coming? There's a thing back here by the driveway. Yeah, she's an old lady. She's got weird shit in her yard. It's like a windmill. Yep. Yeah. I've never been back up here before. Maybe I'm rousing. Rousey. You have now been here. It's nice. Yeah, it's just a bunch of old cabins people turned into houses. 
fun hunting cramps. So don't like get shot or anything. Fuck, she's been here for a few days, right? Oh wow, folks get impatient. For murder! Amber. It ain't murder if it's animals. That's dark. Well, that thought. You gonna knock? Thank you for coming on such short notice. No problem. <coughs> I can see you sleep through a four alarm fire, but that furnace. We'll take a look at it. Ever since Jean passed, I can't. I just can't abide the bumping. Understandable. Jean was such a darling man. Hi. What do you mean by all that thought? Wait for it. Wait for it. I'll never forgive them for taking him away. Uh huh. Ain't like I didn't treat him right. I looked it up on the internet. He didn't smell or nothing. Wait for it. You can't take a woman's husband just because he's dead. There it is. Holy God. Took him right off that couch. It's a crime. Yeah, a crime is definitely committed, alright. They just couldn't abide not being able to tax him anymore, that's what it was. Well, I won't tug your ears off about it. Come take a look at my fridge while you're here. Well, we fell by the half hour. Good job! Yeah, it's a nice fridge. What's the problem? Oh, there's no problem. It's just a classic and original Luna freezer. Wow. They were all their age when I was your age. They last forever, so they make me feel so young. I saw one of these the other day when I got back into town. <coughs> <coughs> oh, oh, really? Where? Upside down in, under some logs in the creek in a ravine. So, furnace. Oh, yes, right through the here to the basement. It sounds good. Come on, man. Alright, we'll be down there for a bit. Please remember not to lock us in. What? The last time we sent someone, he got locked in the basement. I assure you that did not happen. Um, he called me from your basement. Your man did smell a bit of booze when he came by. Oh, uh, okay. But yeah. Or something. Okay, down we go. That was nice meeting you. I don't really know who you are, little person. I don't know who I am either. I'm me. Oh man, I, I love creepy patients. I want one of you. Look at all this splendor. Jeez, she's got a lot of junk. Maybe she's got a few more husbands stacked in the corner. <laughs> Alright, let's get this done so we can go home. This is a league of smoke indoors. It is. Well, 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 be the criminal. It's a dummy. I'm trying to quit. So I chew on this thing. What? Notice no smoke coming out. 
no smoke at all. But like, I've seen you smoke. Yeah, not indoors. I told you that it was real. Where did you think the smoke was going? I thought you were swallowing it. May, do you know how smoking works? I'm sorry, I'm not a smoking scientist, Beatrice! Oh, uh, good lord, what else don't you know? Sorry, I didn't get a degree in cigarettology! What even was your major in college? Cooking ass and getting red. Do you like the furnace? Yes, that's the furnace. I've decided his name is Clinky. Okay, you just hang out. I'm going. I'm going to go fix this right quick. Don't like break anything. What am I going to break? This is a basement full of crap. Oh jeez. Okay, shouldn't be long. Can I help? Nope. Why am I here then? Because you wanted to come along. Just chill. Please, this is one old ass fan. It's me of middle and you could chop your finger off. Hmm, bad mitten. Bad mitten. Bad mitten. Fuck it. I bet I can make something out of all this junk. Dude, who would even have this much junk? <coughs> I need your expertise to fix this stupid finish, Professor. This looks useful. This looks useful. I could see this too being really useful in furnace fixing. Yeah, okay, I can see that being useful. Alright, so I can't carry anything else. So I'm going to say this is enough stuff. So, got a norm of fishing for a badminton racket and a thing. Got two wheels with a tiny thing. And a tiny thing with no wheel. Probably just need to turn the tiny thing. So open up the heat pipes. Turn up the fire. To open them. Clinky's probably got loads of heat, but it kinda got out. So Clinky got all hot and bothered. We'll teach Clinky to love. I bet I could. Hmm, I think Nermy could bite onto the tiny thing. Use the racket as a handle. Yeah, that would work. Although, we're not always going to be able... We're not always going to be here to pull it. One good pull should do it. Okay. Focus! Work this out, man! I wonder why what's like to get stuck in a cave. I saw this thing on TV about people that are scuba diving caves. Which, for my money, is really stupid. Like, in normal swimming, you can drown. But it, you're not in a cave with horses and stuff. Horses? I meant horses. Why am I thinking of horses? OMG. Cave horses. What if you were trapped by a cave horse? I wonder how they pull you out. Probably just have to, to wing it. Maybe some big complicated thing. I can't imagine this little machine made. Just for pulling scuba divers away from cave horses. Although who knows what else happens down there. Ah, uh, focus, Mike! Maybe I should just swing this tool. Just do it fast so I don't overthink it. Okay, let's do it. 
Okay, tie the racket to the turning thing, and then tie that to the fan, but wait! How am I going to keep the fan from running up like a big fan fist? Okay, sorry Nomi, I have to put you upside down like a vampire. I think they used to bury vampires upside down. So when they tried to dig out of their coffins, they just dig, dig, dig out because, ha, ah, stupid vampire. Now you're in the center of the earth and you died. Again. Hi, this looks great. I'm like an engineer or whoever makes machines. A machine engineer? Alright, let's give this baby a go. Okay, done. What? I think I fixed it. Now let's see what we got here. Yeah, we did! Oh, we? What did you do? I engineered an elegant long-term solution! God damn it! Oh, way to go, mate. Please don't fix anything ever again. Like, don't even have a pet. <coughs> anything you have to maintain. Ah, oh, freaking crap! It was totally gonna work! This is so typical! I'm going to check the exit. Wait here. Damn it. Well, we're locked in. Ah, uh, I knew this was gonna happen. Stupid, stupid beat. See if we do the nail. It's not gonna work. Miss Miranda! It didn't work. Well, this knob is really old and loose. Maybe I can, like, figure this out. I look around, too. Yeah, you go look around a whole bunch. Alright, so that's all the time I have for today. How do I save and quit again? Oh yeah, the options. Ha! Ah. That's all the time I have for this episode! <laughs> but it will be back! And as always, I will see you in the next episode. Stay lucky!